Alright, today, another good fun 12AX7 shootout. We got three of them today we're going to go. We got a Telefunken 12AX7. We got a Shuguang of China 12AX7B. It has a triple mica. And then we have a GE from the 70s 12AX7A tall plate. The Telefunken has a tall ribbed plate. I'm going to use that first to stick that in there. We're going to try that. Uh, the Telefunken has a round top getter. It was made in Berlin. This was made in China. Triple Mica. Shiguang, China. And then we got a 70's GE. 12X7A. Right there. It's a tall plate. I'm going to run these in and out and in and out. So everybody knows I have changed no settings. And everything is the same in all three that I'm going to do. No edits on this. this is a straight through video. Telefunken 12AX7 is that one there. That was the Telefunken tube. Made in Berlin, Germany. Now we're going to stick in the Shuguang tube. Let it warm up for a second. This is the Telefunken tube. These tubes are really awesome. It's got tall rib plates. The smooth plate's probably the more desirable version. The rib plate is probably the more cooler sounding, if you ask me. But that's up to you. All right, we have the Shiguang Triple Mica 12AX7B in right now. The guitar in all these is my Firefly FFLP Classic. <laughs> That was the Shiguang of China triple mica tube. This is all in V1 of my PV triple X. This here is the GE 12AX7 tube. Made in America. So we have America versus Germany versus China. And this is the GE tube. What you just heard there was the triple mica china tube now no settings have been changed nothing has been changed same guitar I'm playing with my fingers and not a pick so everything would be the same this is the GE tube <laughs> there you have it that was the GE tube 12 AX7 a tall plate made in the 70s 
down the road from me in Owensboro, Kentucky. All three tubes tested good on my tester. There it is right there. There we are, the three tube shootout right there. Shuguang versus Telepunkin versus GE. All right, there you go, folks. Cool. See y'all later.